a software life cycle originates from development-centric people and ends with operational-centric individuals. Well, that pretty much sums up the traditional software life cycle. Companies earlier on were pouring in millions to develop software and keep them bug-free to help serve their customers and make profits. But unfortunately, the expenses were shooting up due to costly errors, bugs, and faulty workflow. As a result, for decades the software industry was stuck in producing subpar quality software. That all changed when the DevOps concept was first introduced as an extension to Agile methodologies back in 2007. Suddenly companies started taking note of this new way of developing and maintaining software while completely shattering the barriers between the development and the operations team. As a result, DevOps adoption grew massively over the years, and today, surveys forecast that the global DevOps software market will grow to a $6.6 billion market in 2022. Now, in this video, we will discuss top DevOps tools that play a pivotal role in churning out high-quality software that consistently enhances customer experience and improves over time. First, let me address the agenda for today's session. We will start our session with a brief introduction to DevOps. Then, we will understand the need for DevOps and finally, conclude the session with top 10 DevOps tools. I hope the agenda was clear. Before we start with our session, if you like this video, do subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, to learn more about DevOps and its practices, check out Invensys Learning's DevOps certification training which is curated for both beginners and experienced professionals. All of the necessary information is given in the description box below. Without further ado, let us get started with a brief introduction to DevOps. DevOps created a perspective shift toward considering software as a means rather than an end. DevOps isn't a technology but rather a methodology that combines development or dev and operations or ops teams who have different objectives and mindsets towards a software lifecycle. Now, the driver behind massive DevOps success and its benefits are, team collaboration, automation and tools. This was just a brief introduction to DevOps. So now, let us move on to our next topic and discuss. Need of DevOps tools? DevOps reduced a major chunk of tasks, leaving many that need to be automated to improve efficiency and productivity. So here's how DevOps tools help businesses. It provides help to every DevOps stage, starting from planning to monitoring. Next, tools offer an entire picture of the workflow that helps identify various tasks prior. Also, when combined with automation, each tool maximizes efficiency. Next, through these tools, business is optimized and streamlined which speeds up software development and maintenance life cycle. DevOps tools enables a company to focus on creative and innovative aspects rather than tending to repetitive, redundant tasks. These were some of the reasons why DevOps is being so widely adopted by many organizations. Now, let us move on to our main topic for today and talk about the top 10 DevOps tools. Every industry that deploys DevOps tools doesn't have the same requirements. No two companies will have similar requirements even if they belong to the same domain. Before zeroing in on a particular tool, organizations must keep their requirements on top. For example, a company could choose a third-party vendor for a paid centralized, integrated service or choose open-source tools that better integrate with other tools. Here we stacked a list of the top 10 open-source DevOps tools that will help a company get a better idea of selecting a tool they need. It will also help those DevOps aspirants who are upskilling their careers to break into the DevOps domain. So let's start with the first tool. Git. It's a version control system that allows you to keep track of changes within your file. It boosts productivity and eliminates the inefficient process of making separate files and folders for each source code version. Git helps developers easily coordinate the work among the team. If a version goes haywire, it can instantly revert to the most stable version. Now, some of the key features of Git are. It is an open source tool that is free to use. It is very scalable and reliable. It has secure hash functions, to name and identify objects within its repository. Next, it features branch workflow. It allows distributed development that continues without disruption, unlike a centralized development environment. Next, it's easy to implement and compatible with most HTTPS, FTP, and SSH protocols. Next, it is good package for developing mission-critical software. Then, it enables a faster release cycle and supports pull requests. Git is perhaps the most used version control tool among all its competitors. Because it has impeccable support for multiple workflows and packs and high performance, it's considered the de facto tool for handling the code. Microsoft, Amazon, Facebook, Accenture, etc., 
are some of the numerous tech companies that use Git. The next tool is Docker. Docker packages deploy and run apps securely, irrespective of the running environment. The containerization trend is quickly picking up the pace and momentum in the IT sector. And Docker is playing a pivotal role in all this. Every app container consists of a source code, supporting files, system config files, runtime, and all other components required for executing the app. Docker Engine helps access the containers and thereby execute apps even in a remote environment. As a result, Docker has paved the way for lower infrastructure costs which is a huge plus for the adoption of containerization. According to an industrial survey, two out of three companies have adopted Docker within 30 days of trying it out. Some of the key features of Docker are Docker could be used with any language. Next, containers can run in any environment. Next, Docker is capable of scaling to thousands of nodes and it updates without even facing a downtime. Many multinational enterprises and businesses use Docker every day to improve their productivity and lower costs. For example, Uber, eBay, The New York Times, and PayPal use Docker to achieve their objectives. The next top DevOps tool is Slack. Slack is undoubtedly one of the most popular communication and collaboration tools among its competitors. It features user-friendly project management architecture that works well with project management tools like Trello, Twitter, Google Hangouts, etc. Some of the key features of Slack are Slack offers standard, free, and even enterprise versions. It is an intuitive, user-friendly tool. Next, it has strong search capabilities that ease document tracking, file sharing, and management. Next, it offers direct chat, video, or voice calling capabilities. Also, Slack has a host of pre-built integration points, paving the way for numerous solutions for many business tools. Next, Slack can be accessed from desktop and mobile as well and also features extensive storage space. The next DevOps tool is GitHub. GitHub is a popular tool in the collaborative space. Developers use this tool to make quick iterations of the code. While they change the source code, the notification stating this change is sent instantaneously to other team members. So in case of any mishap, developers could easily roll back to the previous version within a few seconds. Some of the key features of GitHub are it is an easy project management tool and helps in effective team management. Next, its packages and code are secured. Next, it supports easy code hosting. The next tool is Jenkins. Jenkins is a popular open source continuous integration server. It automates the complete build cycle of software. In addition, Jenkins offers a pipeline feature, which developers use to commit code to the repository, run test cases, and even fetch test reports. You can also use it for reporting. Jenkins offers a highly customizable tool offering real-time feedback. It helps in tracking bugs faster and eliminating them in the development process. In addition, Jenkins automates most tasks and tools within the entire software development lifecycle. Some of the key features of Jenkins are It is a free open source tool. Next, it can be easily distributed and supports extensible using plugins. Next, it is also easy to install. The next DevOps tool is Puppet. Puppet is an open-source configuration, server management, and deployment tools used within DevOps. Puppet could be organized as reusable modules for a speedy setup and is compatible with many platforms. Some of the key features of Puppet are It is based on master-slave architecture and is an user-friendly intuitive tool. Next, it supports real-time node management, reporting, etc. Many top companies like Cisco, JP Morgan Chase & Company, Teradata, etc., use it. The next DevOps tool is Ansible. Ansible helps in automating apps and infrastructure such as cloud deployments, network configuration, development environment creation, orchestration, etc. Some of the key features of Ansible are It is an open source tool and is based on master-slave architecture. Next, it supports push configuration. Next, it is completely agentless and easy to learn. Next, Ansible features minimal commands and is user-friendly. It does not hang your device because it doesn't have features loaded like Puppet or Chef and it lowers infrastructure costs and increases replication speed. The next DevOps tool is Chef. The Chef could transform infrastructure into code and is a powerful configuration management automation tool. It configures IT and system components like networks, servers, applications, and storage. It's a crucial stage in any SDLC. If we remove the automation part, configuration management is a tedious, resource-draining task. 
Some of the key features of Chef are. It is an open source tool and is easy to integrate with cloud-based platforms. Next, it has an active and fast-growing community support. Companies like Mozilla Firefox, HP, Rackspace, Walt Disney, and Expedia use Chef to handle this crucial phase of their SDLC. The next top DevOps tool is Nagios. The software lifecycle will face infrastructure problems despite following the best industry practices. From an organization's point of view, Nagios helps to identify and resolve it before it affects their business processes. Some of the key features of Nagios are It automatically fixes problems when detected. Next, the server performance issues are monitored and troubleshooted and it helps in planning infrastructure upgrades before facing failure due to outdated systems. Major corporations like Sony, Siemens, Toshiba, and Yahoo use it to monitor and troubleshoot various issues. The next top DevOps tool is Sentry. Sentry is the last tool in our top 10 DevOps tools many companies use for error and bug detection. This tool supports many languages and frameworks. Sentry is built to continuously scan lines of code across the entire system and is programmed to send notifications if it finds bugs or errors. It's much like using Grammarly, it highlights issues and offers an appropriate solution implemented with a single click. So folks, these are our top 10 DevOps tools used across various companies worldwide. And as we mentioned earlier, the features of a popular tool don't mean it could be deployed in the development of every software. Instead, the business requirements are the basis of deciding which tool is suitable for maximizing productivity, efficiency, and team collaboration. The chosen tool must integrate easily with other tools and systems, be compatible with various platforms, possess customizability, offer community and client support, and be scalable and compatible. But, of course, on top of everything is the price factor. So every business must experiment before settling down to its best tools. And businesses need DevOps professionals who have expertise in these tools to recommend them the best tool to get the job done. So, with this, we have come to the end of this video. I hope it was helpful. Comment your thoughts in the section below. Do subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell, never to miss an update from the Invensys Learning Channel. Also, to learn more about DevOps and its practices, check out Invensys Learning's DevOps certification training. It is ideal for individuals and enterprises that are looking to gain a comprehensive understanding of DevOps principles, knowledge, and practical skills. Invensys provides interactive instructor-led DevOps master certification training with highly qualified, certified, and accredited trainers. All of the necessary information is given in the description box below. Thank you. Have a nice day.